ఐఎమ్ డాక్టర్ కొట్లాడి సురేంద్ర శెట్టి కన్సల్టెంట్ స్పైన్ సర్జన్ స్పైన్ కేర్ అండ్ ఆర్థో కేర్ హాస్పిటల్ మాగడి రోడ్ రాజాజీనగర్ ద సేక్రో ఐలియాటిస్ ఈజ్ ద ఇన్ఫ్లమేషన్ ఆఫ్ ద సేక్రో ఐలియాక్ జాయింట్ ఎస్ వి నో దిస్ ఈస్ ద స్పైనల్ స్ట్రక్చర్ ఆఫ్ ద లోవర్ స్పైన్ అండ్ దిస్ ఈస్ ద సేక్రమ్ అండ్ హియర్ కమ్స్ ద ఐలియం ఆన్ బోత్ సైడ్స్ సో ద జాయింట్ బిట్వీన్ ద ఐలియం and the sacrum that is called sacro iliac joint the inflammation of that is the sacro iliac sacro iliitis so it commonly happens with either infection or because of the inflammatory pathology like ankylosing spondylitis so in case of infection and there is no question like uh, no exercises so you have to treat it for the infection depending upon the type of infection whether it is a tubercular infection or the pyogenic infection we have to treat it suppose if it is this ankylosing spondylitis or inflammatory pathology then the main treatment is exercises so we are going to explain so what are the type of exercises now we will demonstrate some of the stretching exercises to the sacroiliac joint the patient is lying down prone leg is made to flex gradually gradually hold the hand like that and keep it stretched now the quadriceps muscle which is there on the front side of the thigh gets stretched so hold it for about 10 counts 10 counts then gradually relax 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 now the opposite side leg gradually bend it hold it with the hand stretch it stretch it stretch it stretch it keep it for about 10 counts then gradually relax so this has to be repeated 10 times we have to hold for 10 counts and repeat it for 10 times then now we will go on for the second exercises prone leg lift so patient is lying down prone the leg is lifted upwards 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 now what is happening the quadriceps muscle as well as the muscles on the front of the hip joint are getting stretched so many of the pain is because of the muscle tightness when a tight muscle gets stretched it pains so if you stretch it then that during our normal activity the stretching of the muscle does not occur hence the pain disappears so that is why all the tightened muscle has to be stretched so we are trying to stretch the muscles around the front of the thigh and now gradually relax it relax it relax relax keep it down and take the opposite leg opposite leg similar way hold it for about 10 counts don't shake don't shake hold it for about 10 counts 10 counts and once the count is done then gradually relax now the opposite leg one after other so 10 times right leg 10 times left leg and every leg you have to hold for 10 counts. Uh, we are going to demonstrate sacroiliac cross leg st stretching. Okay, now the right leg, bend the right leg, right leg, hold the knee and pull towards the opposite shoulder, towards the left shoulder and hold it for about 10 counts. 1, 2, 3, 4, up to 10 then gradually relax 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 and now take the opposite leg left leg yeah. now gradually stretch it towards the right shoulder hold it for about 10 counts hold it for about 10 counts then gradually relax 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 so so this way you have to do alternatively 10 times each 
and now we are going to demonstrate isometric exercises of abductors and adductors of the hip okay now patient has to hold the leg on each side and gradually abduct that is taking the legs away from the center and at the same time with both hands it has to be pressed inwards so that we are doing abduction we are doing taking the leg away from the center under pressure so under the pressure of the hand we are trying to abduct the thighs and these are isometric isometric in the sense the muscles length does not vary here but only the tension inside varies relax relax now hold the hand on mid on the inner side of the thigh and keep a pillow in between the legs and the pillow is made to compress press 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 for about 10 counts then relax relax take the legs away take the legs away yeah now now once again once again once again press press inside press 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 for about 10 counts 10 counts then relax 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 do it about 10 times so this repetition has to be done for about 10 times we are going to do the pelvic tilting exercises so now the patient keeps the legs in the flexed posture so knees bent and the lower back is tilted lower spine is tilted come on okay like that right now the pelvis gets tilted slightly tilted on its own okay do it do this repetition for about 10 counts but don't hold the breath breath should be normal normal expiration normal inspiration and only the pelvis has to tilt forward and backward forward and backward that's all